The FDA has authorized third doses of Pfizer and Moderna's coronavirus vaccine for some people with weakened immune systems. An additional dose could help increase protection for these individuals, which is especially important as the Delta variant spreads. The booster is meant for organ transplant recipients and others who are similarly immunocompromised. We estimate it to be less than 3% of adults. The CDC is expected to recommend the additional shot later today, allowing them to begin immediately. The FDA made no mention of Johnson & Johnson's one-dose vaccine. I didn't even feel that. Transplant recipient Keith Mizimer received a third dose in a trial with Johns Hopkins Medicine. Let's just hope that uh, we get good results because uh, other people are going to need antibodies in their systems too. Transplant patients take medications that impact their responses to vaccines. They don't work as well because we're putting you on things to prevent you from rejecting your liver transplant, your lung transplant, your kidney transplant that's specifically designed to sort of quell <laughs> your immune system. The U.S. is averaging more than a half a million shots a day for the first time since June. San Francisco announced some of the toughest restrictions on the unvaccinated. Proof of vaccination is now required for many indoor activities. Knowing that everyone that comes through the doors is vaccinated will definitely just, just help with everyone's comfort level. The White House says vaccination rates are seeing the highest uptick in states where the virus is rapidly spreading. Ian Lee, CBS News.